Septimus has sent word. Apparently, he sought the consort's forgiveness. He darn sure has. Let me go talk to the consort. And then fucking do whatever. And then go talk to who's. what's his face, I guess. That's not strange. Commander, I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. It was my honor to aid you. You are too kind, Commander. But I would not expect you to help me out of the kindness of your heart. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. I'd be honored. I offer a gift of words, an affirmation of who you are and who you will become. I see your skin, tough as the scales on any Turian, unyielding, a wall between you and everyone else, but it protects you, makes you strong. That strength is what kept you alive when everyone around you was dying. You alone survived. You will continue to survive. This may be who you are, but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. <laughs> That's it. Uh, thanks. <laughs> That's it. Hello? Close your eyes and relax, Commander. Why? Are we having sex? What is going on here? I have no shirt. Are we fucking? Hello? Oh my god. What is going on here? What the f- Oh my god. What the f- What the fuck? What the fuck? Dear Commander, in light of your efforts with the Elcor Ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. What is it? A small mystery. What the fuck? I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. Remember my words, Commander Shepard. <sighs> what the they will give you strength. So I asked, so I was like, that's it? You, you gotta tell me who I am? And then she fucks me. Is that what I gotta do to get girls? <laughs> they tell me what they've seen me, and I'm like, that's it? You are very funny, and I, I love when I talk to you. That's it? Oh, okay. Let's have sex. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Is, why? Why? Why did that happen? Why did that happen? I... Whatever, I guess. Alright, I gotta talk to that, that guy and bring his wife home. Which is... I'm gonna just... I'm teleporting over there. I don't fucking run anymore. I ran too much. I have all these places unlocked anyways. I can afford to teleport places. I'm a big boy now. Allow me to be your guide. I'm really hungry. After this recording, I'm gonna go get some food. Well, we've only been recording for almost two hours. I went a lot long. I still have yet to get off the Citadel, so, like, fuck me. I get. Okay, so I. Pretty much after this, I'm gonna be done. Like, after I get off the Citadel, I'm gonna be done recording, because I need food. I'm hungry. So they finally did it. I knew one of your kind would make Spectre one I'm day. I'm really hungry. I only hope you're better than the one they're sending you after. I strive to. I'll be do everything I can to stop Saren. Hmm. That's what worries me. Was there something you wanted? Ah. What do you know about the Spectre? The right hand of the... More like the underhanded side of the Council. What do you have against the Spectre? I can't abide any organization that considers itself above the law. Especially when it's left up to each individual Spectre to decide when and how to bend the rules. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Goodbye. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. I am. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Yes. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. Ah, Mr. Batya. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help him. Serviceman Nirali Batya died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batya no doubt told you. Yes. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. 
You think her body might be dangerous or contaminated? No, Commander. Nerali Bhatia is not dangerous. Her body is in fact extremely valuable to the Alliance. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Bhatia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Oh. I don't know what to do. I'll tell Samesh. Next time you cut up a dead soldier, at least tell her husband the truth. That was just the reaction we were hoping to avoid. But if you think it will help, tell Mr. Batia the truth. Perhaps he will understand. Please let me know if you have any other questions. I didn't know what happened to him. I hit it, like I didn't want to hit the, the paragon option, and it's like, this isn't right. Release the body. Because her body uh, I, supposedly is going to help out in the future. And it's just, I don't... It's hard. It's a hard choice. Hello, Commander. Has any progress been made with Mr. Bosker? Will he return my wife's body? They're running medical studies on Norelli. That's why they won't release the body. Tests? They're holding my wife's body for tests? My wife served the Alliance faithfully. She gave her life for humanity. And this is how they repay her. Mr. Bacha, your wife died defending humanity. We still need her help. My eyes what are right does droopy. the military have to hold her body? She's already given her life. She died a hero, Mr. Batya, and now she has a chance to save even more lives. It doesn't matter. She's dead. I just want her to come home. I miss her so much. Let them run their tests. Let my wife save lives so that others are spared the loss I feel today. This Goodbye. is really sad. Thank you for finding me answers. I'm sorry. That was upsetting. I actually got upset by this. That upset me. Well, fuck. I gotta go to C-Sec and fucking give that guy his shit. I think that's all I have to do for the Citadel besides scanning the keepers, and I'll do that fucking later. That should be all, right? These are off-world, that's Citadel, and that's reoccurring, I believe, so yeah, this is all I have. This is the last side quest I have to do before I kill myself. Alright, Jaleed, you fucking asshole, you lied to me. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorban? I found out you've been lying to me, Jaleed. Ooh, lying? Blunt. Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the Keeper. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. I'm scanning the Keepers for Shorbin, but you two need to stop fighting. You're... you're helping us? But... well, if you say so. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. Good. I appreciate the help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. You're fucking right, asshole. Alright, that's all the side quests. I can go up to the fucking Normandy. Actually, I gotta go check out the, the shit in the shop. The shop and the shit. Excuse me, pardon me. Alright, let's go check out the, the, sh the shoop. The shoop the whoop. Also, the keeper. The ship the wit. One sec. Looking you up. It's me, Shepard. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Sure is. How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC requisitions officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Any supplies, dog? Show me what you've got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Oh, this must be a mistake. System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. No problem. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stock for you, Commander. Enjoy. 
That's some fucking look at this shit. Wow, dude, master, this is expensive though. I don't have the money for this. I'm not made out of fucking money. I can buy these though. I can I can buy the uh, the store items. These are fucking buying the store item licenses took all my money. Quarians aren't too popular with Citadel security. They think we're all beggars and thieves. Oh shit, that's that's I don't know, that's messed up. Excuse me. Another elevator ride. This might be our last elevator ride for uh, the session. So savor it, please. Do you ever regret leaving Citadel security to pursue Saren? Yeah, yes? what the fuck happened to my audio there? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that beats CSEC. I'm pleased that the imminent destruction of all organic life has improved your career opportunities. <laughs> ah. Oh, you two. You guys are you guys are such jokesters. My leg hurts. Fuck. Uh, this, this recording session is, recording session has been 20 gigs. Fucking end me. But this is a good like 100 parts. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. Well, that's a little messed up. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. I want the truth. Why are you stepping down, sir? You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. What happened? I failed. I couldn't make the cut. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is, I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. Oh, that's upsetting. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. I won't let you down, sir. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got his Geth scouring the Traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Ferro system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact, and there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharos and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. Anything else? We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. I'll start with Liara. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau Cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. But your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. I'll try not to make things any harder on you, Ambassador. Glad to hear it, Commander. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. See you later. Yes, Commander? How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing papers really isn't my thing. But you're the one who can stop, Saren. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. Well, time to get aboard my ship. I own the Normandy now. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Captain Anderson should be the one in charge. It's like I'm stealing the ship from him. Yeah, the captain got screwed. But it's not like you could have stopped it. Nobody's blaming you. 
Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. If you got anything you want to say to the crew, now's the time. Let's be honest with them, boys. This is Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. Uh. The Council wants to ignore this. That's no surprise. They never helped us in the past. No reason they'd start now. But we don't need their help. We can do this on our own. Our enemy knows we're coming. When we go into the Traverse, Saren's followers will be waiting for us. But we'll be ready for them, too. This is the most important mission any of us have ever been on. The fate of an entire galaxy is at stake. We will stop Saren, no matter what the cost. Well said, Commander. The Captain will be proud. The Captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Yes, sir. We can't fail. Even though I got Renegade on that speech for some reason. Probably because I said humanity's in this alone. We can't fail. Alright. So, now we're on the ship. We're still on the Citadel. We could talk to people and all that shit. But, like, uh, whatever. We'll talk to people in the next session. And we'll fly to Liara's planet in the next session. But hopefully, I hope you guys enjoyed this recording session of... Mass Effect, I almost said Dead Space there, of Mass Effect 1. Don't forget to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Call me a fucking idiot in the chat or whatever, you know, whatever whatever all the cool kids do these days. That was a truck. And, uh, yeah. Thank you for watching, and I appreciate everyone for sticking, sticking around this long for this, uh, series of Mass Effect. This is obviously going to be a very long series on my channel. And I'm actually going to try and stick with this series, like all the others. So, Mass Effect's going to probably be the one series on my channel which you're going to see most often. Probably uploaded more frequently than any others. But don't worry, because Dead Space and all that cool stuff will still be on the channel. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I hope you guys have a wonderful time. Say, any last word, Shepard? My name is Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite series on the Citadel. Don't forget to like, favorite, and comment, and subscribe. Don't forget, we gotta fight Saren and beat the Reapers. Because I'm Shepard. Thank you, Shepard. That was well informed. Like Shepard said, do what he said. And, uh, uh, bye.